Hello, Fire Signs. This is Lex. I am here to do a What Do You Need to Know reading today. What we're looking for is any points um, of focus, anything that is coming to you, any advice and need to know information to help you get along within the next couple of weeks. Now, please keep in mind that time is fluid. So whenever you watch this video, this is when you need to hear the message that's given. Please hit that subscribe button if you have not already. And if you would like to reach me or contact me, there is a link in the description to my website, victoryforhope.com. There you can um, book readings and coaching sessions with me. I also teach a um, tarot class every Thursday. Okay. And if by chance Thursday does not work for you, then we can definitely just book a um, a personal coaching session and we would just um, go over the tarot if that's what you like. If you don't want to um, join along with others because there, you know, or other people want to be in there. Okay. All right. So right now what we're getting is your overall point of focus for the near future. Holy Spirit, please anoint the cards. Allow them to fall where they should and me the ability to interpret the way that I should. Give me clear-cut, concise messages on what my fire signs need to know. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. All right, my fire signs are going to be Leos, Sagittarius, and Aries. Okay. All right. Your main point of focus is going to be the five of water. Things not turning out the way you hope, not seeing the positive in a situation, crying over spilt milk. So this, we're going to clarify this. Definitely, you do not need to focus on things that have gone wrong. You, what you need to do is learn what you can from the situation and move forward, especially, um, Learn the lesson because the card does say that you're not seeing the positive in the situation. Just because things did not pan out the way that you wanted them to does not mean that all is lost. You may need to uh, revisit the way that you approach things. You may need to um, maybe the timing is wrong or maybe there's just something else going on as to why it didn't pan out. Maybe just maybe there's something out there better for you that you never consider or maybe that was not available and this would have prevented you from receiving what has been divinely guided for you okay so uh what we're going to do we're going to get a couple of life purpose oracles and then clarify everything All right, we have sensitivity. Try to keep the glare off of it, guys. Sorry about that. Music. And spiritual teacher. Okay. Um, you're becoming more sensitive and need to make changes accordingly. Crying over spilt milk, things not happening the way that you want. So maybe you're acting out and you're giving everybody around you some grief. Okay. Listen to some good feeling music. Your connection um, to music is healing for yourself and also other people. Okay. Listen to some good feeling music. Okay. Also seek out the help of your spiritual um, mentor, advisor, pastor, teacher, whoever it is that you turn to for guidance here. Okay. Yeah, this is that five again. You're crying about it. You're frustrated about it. It didn't go the way that you wanted to. You feeling like everybody's against you. Maybe you feel like you were betrayed or backstabbed. You see all these swords going into the sky's back. Maybe that's how you're feeling right now. Okay. And you're you're deciding whether or not you should let this go or go into another direction. That's why you need to 
see this the spiritual connection of things okay before you take action i know you are ready to get this thing moving this knight of wands this is a very fast moving action card this is um the second fastest knight in the deck all right so don't jump into anything just because it didn't happen as quickly as you want to does not mean that all is lost and don't be worried about the past the six of um the six of cups is romanticizing fantasizing thinking about things from the past also being childlike in the situation okay all right what we're gonna do now is pull um a whisper of love or what we're asking here is how to bring more love into our lives how to be more loving to others and ourselves because we attract who we are and for those of you who are already in a relationship what we're asking for is how to strengthen sustain and renew existing love okay all right fire signs what we got all right this is number 18 and 18 reduces to a nine goes to a nine and nine is going to be an action card okay so before acting hold this up while you can see it and then i'll read the full link description to you it says oh, i did this on the last one went one page sorry about that one page too far all right let's try this again it says embrace your emotions don't push down your feelings or judge your emotions feelings and emotions are part of who you are allow yourself to feel what is going on for you your feelings signal you the truth of a situation take positive steps positive steps to determine why you are feeling the way that you feel okay so again although things are not gonna always go how we want to what is the lesson learned here what is the positive spin on things there's always even in the worst of situations there's always something good that can come of it okay always i know that's hard to believe in some situations and that's easier said than done. Trust me. I know. But you have to so that you can move on from this. Okay. All right. So what I'm doing now is I'm pulling a living Reiki healing card. Healing card. This is overall advice as to um, wrap and tie everything together. Okay. All right. What have we got? So you know what? I'm trying. One jumped out at me, but there we go. And it says, "Calm. Be calm. Just for today." I will let go of worry. All right. So take it one day at a time. Fire signs. All right. Just for and when you start feeling your mind go back to that dark place, back to this five of cups energy. Tell yourself to remain calm and to not worry about it because all things work together for good. OK, no matter how bad it may seem. All things work together for good, all right? So fire signs, that is what you need to know right now. I hope this resonates. If it does not, check some of the other videos that highlight your moon rising or Venus signs. Those sometimes resonate with us better. Hit that subscribe button if you have not already. And if you would like to contact me, there is a link in the description to my website, victoryforhope.com. Take care.